Okay, so we're gonna show you really quick how to safely tie up the back legs so you don't get kicked. You don't wanna get in the back, you don't wanna get up here in the front, so you wanna stay off to the side. I'm gonna wrap this around like this and tie it onto itself and bring it up about this high, okay? I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna throw it around like that. See how I stay back here? Then I reach and grab like that. And then I pull it around like this, okay? Once that's pulled around like that, I'll tie once around here like that. And then now that she's pretty much tied, so she can't kick that well, she could still pull her foot out. So what I'm gonna do is reach around like this and go around twice and then loop like that. Now she's tied and she can't kick me and I didn't put my head which is very important behind her at all. I stayed off to the side because a cow can't kick this way. They can only kick back and forward. And that way you don't run the risk of getting hit or kicked by the cow when you're tying her up. Another very important thing after you've tied her up, you always want to make sure she's got something to eat in the bucket while you're tying her up. That, keep her, that keeps her focused on eating so she's not worried about trying to to kick or mess with you. And I also make sure I put some stuff in the buckets in, in this little tiny pen thing so that this other cow and these calves don't come and bother her while I'm tying her up or milking. So I give them a little bit of the, of the grain mix as well, as well as Annie. So that's the best way I know on how to tie her up.